Built Delta downfall. Not only is the variant dangerous if you're unvaccinated, but now potentially problematic for you if you got the Johnson & Johnson vaccine. There are some doctors that are questioning just how effective that vaccine is against the Delta variant. So the question is, should you get another shot of a different vaccine? NBC Barrios Demian Trujillo is at the Santa Clara County Public Health Department with a closer look at what the CDC and health departments are saying. The public health department says it will continue to give J&J &J to people here, saying they still trust its efficacy. Some people agree, others say they're not so sure. No Tina way. Cano took the Johnson & Johnson COVID vaccine back in April. One and done is how she put it. To be honest with you, I'm paranoid of shots. Look, when I went to get that Johnson & Johnson, it was like I, I did it because I knew it was my this is my part that I have to do. But with conflicting studies about whether J&J &J can protect against the Delta variant, some people are thinking about going back for a Pfizer or Moderna shot. That includes the Ortega family vacationing in Hawaii. My grandson is the only one that got the J&J. &J. And um, we've been really kind of thinking about and talking about it as a family as to whether or not the J&J is enough of a vaccine for him. But the Santa Clara County Public Health Department says a booster shot is not needed right now, no matter which vaccine you took. The j, &J vaccine, as well as the other two vaccines, are working as intended. Dr. George Hahn says everyone hospitalized with COVID in a Santa Clara County hospital right now is not vaccinated. He says that's clear evidence all vaccines are proving to be effective. At this point, uh, you know, the federal government has said uh, no booster shots are, are required or recommended, uh, and the county agrees with that uh, statement. And so we're not going to, at any of our county vaccine sites, be able to provide any booster shots. Tina Cano says she's not worried. I trust Johnson & Johnson. The CDC says it does too. In San Jose, Damian Trujillo, NBC Bay Area News.